Kill him. Oh, yeah! Good shooting, boys! Yeah! What up, y'all, and welcome back to another one. This is the fourth hunt here in Alberta. It's a good one. We've been doing six mans every time. And by the way, I hope you guys are enjoying the videos. But today, it's a little bit different. It's actually a lot different. A lot different spread, as you can see behind me. We got some white decoys out. I'll show you the spread here in just a second. But today, it's only a four man. Using layouts again. It's a pea field again. I'm telling you, the birds love the pea fields here. This is the early migration. These birds, one reason why they're so vulnerable, this is the beginning of the migration. And they have to travel over, you know, it might be a 20 mile or a 100 mile portion of just bush without any cropland. So when they get to this area, particularly where we're at, they just had to cross about 100 miles of bush. When they hit this area, when they hit these pea fields, they're hungry because they've been beating them wings waiting for some food, just having water to lay on and, ro and rest on and, and roost on, you know what I mean? But before we get going, I gotta give a massive shout out to duckswaterfowl.com. Without them, I would not be up here. We got a bunch of new thermal hoodies. We got like four new designs of them. And we got that bottomland hat pullback. Good for the cold weather, y'all. These things are warm. Right now it's sitting at about 49 degrees. You know, I ain't used to it, but it feels good. These thermal hoodies, they are warm. If you want to pick them up, I will link them down in the description below. But enough chattering. Look at what we got going on today. It's going to be a beautiful sunrise. Absolutely gorgeous sunrise. Got some white decoys out, like I said. Beautiful. What are you doing back here? Oh, oh you, you don't have a wrench, I take it. Or pliers. <laughs> No wrench, no pliers. I'm just trying to think of what I can use to get them off, and then we can use that for the clones. We're having to get this battery out of here. <laughs> the one I had's dead. We, we need it there. for some decoys. Like I said, I'll show you the spread here in just a little bit. We're dealing with a lot more wind today. Hopefully the birds react better with this much wind. We're going to be sitting at about a 20 mile an hour wind with up to 30 mile an hour gusts. So the socks will be dancing. Well, I figured I'd show you the spread here while we have the light. So out this way, we got a bunch of full bodies. Right here, we got the layout blind sitting at the back of the spread. Here at the back of the spread, we got some white decoys, some snow goose decoys. We got the mojos right next to the blinds, so you can just turn them on and off. We don't have remotes for them up here. But the idea with the white decoys is to basically mask the shadow that the layout blinds will be casting. And up front, we got some motion decoys. We got some flappers. Then we got some more silos and full bodies strung out to the right side. We're going to be looking into the sun a bit, but hopefully them white decoys will be blown out and will hide us a little bit better. That's the theory. Yeah. You get it? Hey. You needed somebody from the States, eh? <laughs> you needed somebody from the States, eh? <laughs> oh, no, no. No, no, no. Ooh, geese on the right. Get in, get in. Well, it's shooting light. First birds here. Man, they're on, they're on the ground, boys. It is right at shooting light and we got birds. You guys ready? Specs. Do them. Nice shooting, boys. Oh, 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 oh. We got it. We got one. Oh. You're all right. There we go. Nice. Oh, yeah. Nice shot, dude. Woo. We just got into them literally right at shooting light. It just turned shooting light. I hope y'all can see me. Woo! They're, they're banging, boys. <laughs> uh, can they see me? Can you barely, see me? Barely. Barely see me? Yeah. Oh, that was awesome. We just got into them, boy. Boy, a group of geese coming low on the deck, boys. No calling needed here. They're going to want to shortstop us. They're gonna go right. Shoot them. Oh yeah. Let's go. Nice. Woo! Four man just doing work, dude. Load up, load up, load up. They're gonna come over again, boys. Here come. Oh, come back over. Hold on, hold on. Here they come. Here they come. Here they come. Hold on, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Go. 
Oh, you got hit, water. boy. Woo! Nice, we dude. Just lifted that roof nice. <laughs> Blow it up, boys. It's gonna get wild today. It's <laughs> western out here. Oh goodness. Let him come. Let him come. Use your side. Smoke that. Smoke him. Oh, only had two in. Darn it. Well. There, yeah, man. buddy. Boy, when they come in without no noise, they you do not need to call. These birds are on the deck this morning. The yep. Two coming in right on the deck. You call it. I'm filming. Do it. Do it. Do it. Oh, yeah. Nice. Wasn't. Ooh, I spilled some sprinklage coming at us right here i mean they are their belly you're right their bellies are just a scraping boy they come low these are honkers yep yeah. these are lessers ready go boys <laughs> Woo! <laughs> That was good, dude. That was good. See ya, buddy. All right. Well, we got two lessers on the ground. Uh, we're five specks away from a four man. Uh, it's been shooting light. What time is it? I'm uh, not even sure. Let's see. It is 7 11. <laughs> and uh, so, yeah, it's been shooting light for about 30 minutes. And uh, what is that? We had 13, 13 right? Yeah. And plus 13 two, 15 plus two. birds on the ground, four shooters. This is going good. Small spread. Crawling again. No calling. If he goes your way, you're going to have to pop him. Nice shoot. Oh, I clicked. <laughs> <laughs> Shoot him. I clicked again. My gun, that's the second time I've clicked. Oh, uh, he's dead now. Them boys are dead anyways, but that's the second time I have clicked. Yeah, the calling worked well. If you like the video so far, you know what to do. You should have already smash the thumbs up button for me. <laughs> Am I lying? That's the good one. Boy, howdy, this is why we came. This is why me and Wade came to Alberta. Jeremy's like, Bob, get here. I've been watching you since 40K. Uh, get here. I want to put you on birds. I promise I will put you on birds, you know? And that's that's a big, that, that's what it's all about. Get your butt in here, get on some birds, and I'll tell you what, Jeremy at 780 Outdoor, he's awesome. He gets it done, man. Two big long necks. Long necks, boys. Boys, it is starting to rain bad. Oh, goodness. The rain has picked up on us. Shoot him. There we go. Oh, he should be in the Olympics. Look at that. Oh, that poor guy. Goodness. Decoy just got nailed, too. <laughs> we are getting a lot of rain. Look at the rain to come, boys. It is raining. I mean... It ain't sprinkling anymore, boys. It's raining, and I just, I got the old Ducks thermal hoodie on, you know, out here just. <laughs> shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. Oh, 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 God. I'm sorry. I did not see them birds, boys. I'm sorry. I think they see me. Oh, dude, I did not see them I birds. I was trying to say, dude, I didn't see them. Okay. Yeah, shoot him. He's down. Oh, that boy dead. Ho, oh. ho, 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 ho. Well, time check, 7.55. Uh, what do we got on the ground now? We got, was that 16? 16. 
16 birds down, no ducks, no ducks, no snows. Uh, there was just a small, small group of snows here. This horrible weather would be the day to decoy some adult snows, you know. Like I always say, the only time I've ever killed them is when you got some weather. Looks like the rain should be stopping. It's gonna be breaking any time. We are all just a little wet. <laughs> <laughs> That was. I got greedy there. Whoops. <laughs> they love that moan though. They come right to the moan. You know? Shoot him. Oh, nice shot. Here, on the right, on the right, on the right, here. He did. There we go, boys. Redeemed ourselves off the other ones. There we go. Man, I, I, when I was back here, I had like the butt of the gun on my neck. Did you? Yeah, it nailed me right in the jugular. Oh, those reach backs. Man, that butt of that gun was right here and it just went. <laughs> hey, right here, lower to the right. Right, 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 right. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at these birds just on the deck. <laughs> Pull them in there, Wade. Pull them in there. There you go. There you go. There you go, dumping, boys. Stop cussing. So who's gonna shoot him first? You gonna shoot him first? Who's gonna hit him? Do it. Go! <laughs> I think he got double tapped because I seen someone over there, he went boom, and then you backed him up and it went. The specs here, they do it. They do it right. You don't have to have a big spread out. Like I said, today we have, what is it, 16 dozen, 15 dozen at most? Yep. That's it. Small spreads up here. That's what makes it nice. <laughs> On your right side or left side? We should have shot him right there. There he goes. There we go. Shoot him. Shoot him. Nice. Oh, <laughs> that boy is all sorts of dead. <laughs> Woo! That was a good shot, dude. dude. That, that was dude sweet. Broke, hold on, hold on. You gotta walk that out. How many? Hold on a minute. How far is it? Watch this. Watch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten steps, boys, and you demolished him. Oh goodness. He's a little, he's a little messed up. <laughs> Got some honkers on the, on the right. Here we go. Kill him. Oh yeah! Good shooting, boys! <laughs> nice, boom. dude! Dude, awesome. we, yeah. we and you went low, yeah, they were done, right. and then we yeah, picked up. Right, yeah. Dude, that was Damn. sick! <laughs> <laughs> Woo! That, that deserves a thumbs up, boys. It, it only takes .02 seconds. Come on! Get this video over 3,000 likes. Let's just do it! God! Well, it has gotten just awesome. Picked back up. It got slow for a bit. And then picked back up. We are limited, limited. Actually, one short. We can we can shoot one Canada, 
but uh, as a lot of you know that's been here for a while, I don't, I don't like just hitting it on the head. Leave yourself some room. There's no reason to hit it on the head every time. We're good where we're sitting. So we are done on specs and lessers. So that's Honkers, Lessers, Canada's specs. 32 birds on the ground, four man in it, layout blinds. Small, small spread. Let's check it out real quick. I haven't really got to show you guys. And it is 8.52, so got her done pretty early. Not bad at all. It rained on us. Uh, it's beautiful now though. This is the kill hole here. And uh, we got full bodies wrapped around mixed with some dive box silhouettes. 15 dozen, that's it. Got her done, you know. Didn't take a big spread today. Uh, we started with two clones here, two Snow Goose clones flappers. Uh, we ended up pulling them out. And then where the blinds are here, we actually had a lot more white socks and we ended up pulling most of them out. And we've seen an automatic difference when we did that. When it was low light this morning, right at shooting light, those specks, they seen the white, they seen the white flappers, they came right to it. Once the sun got up, once it started getting lighter out, they didn't like the white. So. You always got to adjust, I always tell you guys, if something's not working, switch it. So if the birds react and then they stop reacting, switch something up. Pull some decoys, make the hole bigger, put some family groups out in the hole, just try something. Well, got her all picked up here, check it out. Got one seed sack left to load. Got the old pile, I'll show you here in one second. But you guys have been enjoying when I go around to the guys and I ask them what kind of shotgun they run. So, that's what we're going to do. We haven't got to see Wade's old arsenal, arsenal over here. What are you rocking out on over here? The only one that kills anything. The only one that kills anything. Listen to him. A antique SV2. SV2. What are you rocking out on, Jeremy? Stoger M3500. Stoger M3500. This is the first time I've actually seen one. A lot of you viewers have the Stoger M3500s. When I went in to goose hunt and I researched best entry level goose gun. Right. And this was one that popped up. And yeah. It's eight hundred to a thousand dollars, and it's been a great gun. It works harder than I do. So. Yeah. See, and I was debating between the thirty-five hundred and the Franke Forever. Yeah. I would have got the thirty-five hundred, but Wade's brother actually had the Affinity Forever, and he's like, "Bob, just trust me. You need to try it." Which I'm glad I did. But what are you rocking over here? I run the Benelli SBE three. Oh, got the old three with Carlson Cremator. <laughs> Earlier he was like, you got the cremator on, huh? And I'm like, yeah. Never jams, that's the biggest thing. There's no problems with it. Never have a problem no. with the SB3? Never. I have a buddy back home and uh, he ballooned his barrel. You know who you are. <laughs> on his SB3 because he ran too full, tight of a choke oh, with shit. steel. He ran T-shot through it. Ooh. Don't do that with a full choke. Ross, you know I'm talking about you. Well, here we go. 19 specs, 11 Canada's. Awesome, awesome four-man hunt today. Well, we're just burning through Canada fields here. It's insane how many pea fields there actually is up here. A ton. That's what you end up hunting up here. Literally every hunt is pea fields. At home, you might hunt a cut wheat field, you know, a lot of corn field hunts. But up here, the ticket is pea fields. They're everywhere. birds gonna have a nice little catch clean and cook tonight but this is a little dad's trip it's time to do some dad things and that means <laughs> oh yeah boys time to swing some irons yeah you know we better do some stretches we better do some warm-ups <laughs> because I don't want to be I don't want to be messing my shoulder up my shooting arm you know what I mean we got we got some more shooting to do here oh yeah oh stretch it out get it yeah. <laughs> well, old Jeremy up to tee off first. Oh my goodness, with the crush a thon. Goodness, dude, that was well, nice. You want to go right to the corner like that. Yeah, well, you've only done this three times every week, okay? You just right, just right there. That's yeah, just, just do. do it just oh, like yeah. that. Do oh. it just like that. <laughs> <laughs> Now we have Wade Dosh up to tee off. Oh, not bad. 
You'll find that. Nice high shooter gonna stay on the fairway. You I'm guys like my that. commentator voice? I know it, I know it. <laughs> Here you go, Bob. Yeah, You're well, up. this is gonna be a, a ball. bad deal. All right, while, yep. It's been a while. Here we go. It's gonna be a sad day. Right, I'd, I'd watch out. Ball, <laughs> That's the biggest thing. I'd watch out. Eye on the ball. Yeah, I know. It's been a long while, dude. Oh, you got it. It's been a long while. Oh God! <laughs> I told you I was gonna hit that building. It's a camper. I think got it teed up a little high as all. Hey, hey, we'll find. Hey, out. I'll take it. I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> I actually teed up and I I redid it. All right, I used a driver and I just crushed it. Oh, I miss golfing. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Uh, today's video was an awesome one. Little four man lay down blind hunt. Alberta is serving me and Wade up with just the sauce, let me tell you. This is my first one. I'm picking it up. I know, I'm cheating. I'm cheating. I don't care. Alberta, it's, 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 it's beautiful. Uh, we're going to be spoiled going back home. Uh, we're not going to be able to decoy birds at home like we do here. You know what I mean? But if you guys like the video, smash that thumbs up button. Uh, that's, that's how you let me know that you liked it. And if you want more waterfowl hunting, well, you need to subscribe because we're coming at you guys with two, three, up to seven videos a week. Literally some weeks we go daily. But there will be one to two more Alberta hunts to come. Uh, be expecting them. Uh, if you haven't followed me on social media, do it right here on Instagram. And be sure to follow Jeremy at 780 Outdoors. He has a YouTube channel, Instagram. If it wasn't for him, man, he's been putting us on the birds. Big shout out to Jeremy and the boys. Wade's just over here chunking grass everywhere. But we'll see you on the next one, guys. Peace.